Hey guys, welcome back to another interesting video. Today's topic is on strict priority or fixed priority arbitration. This is the second video in the series of code RTL where I'll be explaining the specification, then design it and then verify it. So if you're a beginner, please watch this video till end and you'll get a good understanding about the VLSI design. Now let's get back to the fixed priority arbitration. In a design, when multiple sources need to share a common resource, we need arbitration scheme. And fixed priority is one such scheme. In this arbitration scheme, the requesting source has a fixed prioritization. To understand this, let's take a real world example. So let's say that you are traveling in a public bus. To take a seat, there's a priority. Elders and needy person take the seat before you. It's very similar in the design while sharing the resources. So let's say there are three agents, agent zero, agent one, and agent two. And agent zero has the highest priority and then agent one and then agent two. The highest priority agent will continue to get the grant from the resource as long as it keeps the request high. The chance of getting grant for low priority agents will reduce and it's a starvation for them. This arbitration scheme is good for giving the differential services for very important and high priority agents. Now let's start the design. So this is the specification. LSB has the highest priority in the request and there should be no grant at the output if no request is asserted. In this design, we consider four agents. So we have four requests and request zero has the highest priority. If more than one request is high at same time, then the grant will be based upon the priority. Here, request zero has the highest priority. So grant zero is high. Let's code the design now. Uh, this is the module definition. And the name of the module is fixed priority underscore P. To define the number of agents, we are using a parameter. And the parameter name is numports. And its value is four. Now let's define the ports. We have a request as input and grant as output. Let's close the module with end module and let's start the logic. As per the specification, LSB has the highest priority. So request 0th bit is directly assigned to grant 0th bit without any condition. If request 0th bit is high, then grand zero bit will be high. Now let's declare a gen variable i, which will be used in the for loop, where i equals to one, and it's less than the num ports, and i equals to i plus one. We will assign request i to grant i based on a condition, so we are ending it. As you know, there should be no grant for the lower bits to get the grant, so I'm using a reduction or operator and then negating it. Let's say the request is 1010. Then 0th bit will be assigned to grant 0th bit, that is 0. And for i equals to 1, request i is 1. And this logic is 1. So grant 1 will be 1. For i equals to 2, it will be 0. And for i equals to 3, it will be 0. So the grant is 0010. Uh, we can apply various inputs from the test bench. So this is the module test bench where reg and wires are declared over here based upon the design module. Here's the instantiation of the design. And from this initial block, we can apply requests. And based upon the value of i, request i is changed. And there is a delay of 5 nanoseconds between each input. And after the loop, we are exiting using the dollar $finish. And from this initial block, we are getting the wave dump. Now let's run the design. And here I'm using iverlog for compiling and simulation and GTK wave for waves. We are compiling the test bench and the design fixed priority and the result is placed in this VVP file fixed underscore p dot VVP. And the result is executed with the VVP command, this will generate a dump BCD as per the name given in this test bench. 
and we are opening the dump using this gtk wave command so here's our wave dump let's add the variable I value changes from 0 to 31. Request i is of 4 bits, so it will change from 0 to 15 and then again 0 to 15. Now let's check the output grant. When request is 0, then grant is 0. When request is 1, grant is 1. When request is 2, grant is 2. When request is 3, that is 0011, you can see the priority of LSB. So grant is 0001. Similarly for others. Let's check when request is 14. You can see LSB is 0. So the next highest priority is for first bit so grant is 1. When all the requests are high, LSB has the highest priority so grant is 0001. And this is the code for fixed priority arbitration. And if this video is helpful for you, please do subscribe and hit that like button. Thanks for watching. Be brave. Jai Hind.